believers, Joel Pal, Spider-Man. Hey, Cadre, it's KJ here. Uh, happy Monday and happy Labor Day. Uh, hope you all have the day off like I do so you can sit and enjoy the holiday. Um, since it is a holiday, I am going to take a break from my normal Techmatic shapes and I decided to bust out my uh, WEC Sexto Blade. Um, uses a hair shaper blade. <clears throat> In my opinion, of all of the Shavettes, this one most uh, uh, most approximates uh, the feel, uh, the weight, the balance of an actual straight razor. Um, between this one and the, the, the Feather Shavette, I think those are the best two Shavettes that there is. Um, a lot of people prefer the blade of the feather over the blade of the weck, um, but I think that the feel of the weck is much better than the feel of the uh, the feather. So we're going to continue on with our uh, spike timber. So I've got my spike stick and I'm going to face lather and load. I decided to uh, use the WEC partly because of how good and slick a lather I was getting from the spike. Um, so I thought that was a pretty good um, soap to use for my first time using a WEC in a very, very, very long time. Um, and it is an old blade in there. I have no idea how many shaves it's got on it. Um, but I'm not too worried about it. So again, just to make sure I get enough, I just like to do a little bit of a, uh, a load directly onto the soap. Get some of that extra stuff that I got loosened up from my pre-soak into the brush. I'm not worried about getting too much rather just have too much than not enough soap in there. Definitely for the cadre, this is gonna be the first time I've done a any kind of a straight razor or shave at shave on camera. So many straight users on the forum and lots of you that do vlogs are straight users so I'm kind of feeling a little bit left out. You know the main reason I don't get into straights is don't really have the stones or the skills to hone them myself. And just never found the time to really get into figuring it all out. I bought a set of uh, lapping film, but still just never found the time to bust them out and give them a try. But I do enjoy the Shavettes just because the uh, maintenance is a lot less and they're pretty easy. I've used lots and lots of different kinds of shavettes. I use all different kinds of blades, whether they be full DE blades, half DE blades, single edge blades, um, chic injector blades, feather injector blades, hair shapers. Uh, use shavettes that use the old uh, Persona uh, super wide pathology blades. Uh, I think I've used a shavette for every single blade that they make. And to me, the WEC is about as bet the good as it gets. So, 
and we'll give this a try and see how we do. It's been so long, I'm gonna have to uh, really concentrate on my angles and technique too. Just like riding a bike, right? I always dread doing the chin with a straight razor. Well, that was the easy part, right? Right hand. Now let's switch over to the left. So overall, not a bad pass. I know bingo just started. First calls are out there. We're playing two cards. And I got a hit on both of my cards with the same number. So I'm one for three. Uh, still waiting to see the final outcome for the college football pickums. See who's in the lead for that. Sure, it's not me. I know nothing about college sports at all. I don't watch them, don't care about them. 
Possibly because I went to a school that didn't have intercollegiate sports, so it never really became important to me or relevant. And my family just didn't grow up being big sports fans anyways. But, I like being a part of things like that on the forum, even if I'm not totally interested in it. We still have fun with it. It's been really fun trying to do this, just looking at my camera. So slick, I can't really grip onto my skin to pull it. So that's about all I'm gonna do for that. I don't do a uh, against the grain pass with straight razors. I'm not, I don't have that kind of skill yet. So, okay shave. Not as good as I could get with the uh, DEs or the, uh, even the Techmatic, but with those I'm doing and against the grain pass to clean it up and I'm just not gonna do that with this razor. I would kill myself. Um, no blood, no weepers. I did kind of hit the point right on my nose uh, for a split second. Um, it's not bleeding, but hurts a little bit. Which is a good thing. We are using the Spike aftershave. And that will help heal me up. So, along with it being Labor Day, I know lots of our favorite shaving sites 
also have Labor Day sale going on. Um, I know just from my uh, recent memory of emails that I've got in, uh, Prix de Provence is doing a sale, uh, Bull Goose is doing a sale. Um, there was one other one. I don't remember, but, uh, oh, fragrance.net is doing a sale. I think Don posted about that one earlier. Um, I actually did go on there and bought some, uh, Creed samples, little teeny tiny ones, uh, from their website. I uh, got, uh, three samples for 30 bucks. Uh, I think they're 2.5 milliliter samples. Um, so I got those coming and we'll be reviewing those shortly. Um, but like I said, there's a lot, there's lots of sales out there. So if you've got a favorite site, go out, check it out, see if they've got a sale running. Uh, hopefully you're on the mailing lists, but usually, uh, you don't need to be on the mailing lists to take part in the sales. Uh, they just let you know about them. So go to the website, see if they've got anything on their, uh, on their banners about sales. Um, if you are in the market for new shaving stuff, might as well, uh, Get a good deal on it. So uh, go check out the sites. Have a good uh, Labor Day, and we'll see you guys on the forums.